Oh, you're looking at a 1994 GMC box truck that has low mileage and really is in nice shape. This belonged to a gas company in, a, in rural Maryland and uh, they had a couple of them and I got two of them and uh, they run really well, they were well maintained, got good tires all the way around, good tread on them. This one has a brand new battery, runs well, starts right up, even has cold air conditioning and it is a 3500. The label shows the gross vehicle weight to be 14,000 pounds. Has a GM engine, and uh, it sounds great. I can't see the size, but I'm going to imagine it's a 350. Fleets like this are very well maintained. They are a utility, and uh, they take very good care of their trucks. Uh, I always like fleet-maintained vehicles, government-owned vehicles, and utility-owned vehicles. The bed is in real nice shape. It's a wood floor. It does look like in the corner they had a leak at some point right there, but also it looks like it was sealed up. Well, it feels nice and solid, and the door looks almost new. Rollers are good, the door itself is good, uh, and that is a nice plus. Usually in your box trucks, uh, any box truck nowadays, number one, they're worn out from being used, and number two, the doors are all banged up and, and don't open and close very well. This one does. and lock. I was trying to measure the I'm going to imagine it I, I believe that's a 12 foot cargo area 12 foot so it's in real nice shape for a 94 a couple little cracks in the paint right there but other than that really is nice. Well, I gotta close the other door. It's not rusty underneath. You can see here. I would bet this wouldn't take much uh, to pass an inspection at all. Seventy-three thousand original miles. It has a receipt in there from when they bought it new. The air is blowing cold now. We'll take a quick ride down the highway. We'll have to drive through the shopping center first. So, I'm going to tell you that we're located in Bel Air, Maryland, which is about 20 miles north of Baltimore. We're right off of I-95. Um, if you're coming from out of town, we will pick you up at the Baltimore, Washington International Airport, or the uh, there's a bus called the Mega Bus that comes to the White Marsh area. It's a real nice ride. Um, pick you up there. Or the Aberdeen train or bus station, Aberdeen, Maryland.
go. When you come to pick this truck up, we will give you a temporary license tag, the title, uh, bill of sale, and everything you'll need to uh, title the vehicle in your state. So if you have a business that needs a box truck, you'll be surprised how nice this is when you get in it. I do also have a steak body on right now. Not a steak body, a uh, step van also. So you can take a look at that. If you don't end up getting this vehicle, keep me as a favorite seller. Because I, I like this type of vehicle. I, I sell a lot of them. I should remember that this is one of the longest red lights in the world, but anyhow, there we go. in there too. It is a no reserve auction so please do not bid unless you have your finances together. You'll need uh, $250 at the end of the auction and then the balance is due within seven days. Now you don't have to pick it up for 30 days, but the balance is due within 7 days. an idea how she drives. It'll drive you home wherever you're from. If you're looking for a cheap, low mileage truck, it's got a lot of life left in it. This one would be for you. Buy this GMC box truck. It's a nice truck and a rare bird in the world of rocks, uh, box trucks, be low mileage and in nice shape like this.